So this video is sponsored by Cyberpower UK. They build a lot of awesome PCs. If you do want to go check it out, I will leave the link down in the description. Alright, so what is going on guys? Welcome to another episode of Slime Rancher here today. Today is episode number 21. In yesterday's episode, I said it was episode 21, but that's because it actually was. I had an issue with the audio or the commentary on episode 20. So I've not been able to upload that video for you all. So what I'm actually going to be doing today is we're going to do a little bit on the teleporter. And then I'm going to head over to the glass desert and show you exactly what we did. Then we're going to come back. We're going to get the materials from the, uh, the devices and everything that we're going to make. And hopefully we can craft the teleporter. So I have been a little bit busy off screen. I've actually been uh, growing uh, a couple of these uh, silver parsnips. Are they called? Is it silver parsnips? Uh, yes, it is. So I've got uh, quite a few plots of those going. Uh, I've got some more pogo fruits in here for the dervish slimes. So uh, the dervish plots are going quite well. In here, these aren't actually being fed. These crystal slimes aren't actually being fed right now. Uh, these are the rock quantum, uh, not rock quantum. These are the rock uh, mosaic, and the mosaic's up absolutely full right now. So let me grab some of these plots out here. We're going to put them in a silo in just a second. Let me just grab those. We don't want those going through and, uh, and accidentally making tag now, do we? So let me just grab these nice and quickly. Uh, there we go. Just going to need to throw one more in there. There we go. And uh, we're almost full again. So let me go put these in the silo over here. Because I don't actually want to spend these just yet. Because the currency of these is actually quite high. And I think if you use quite a lot of them, um, the value of them goes down quite significantly. So if we actually take a look at the value of these right now, the mosaic ones are worth 111. The... Um, these ones are worth 141, and the Tango ones are worth 102, but look at the gold plots. I've never seen it at 564 before. That is ridiculous, but also because I've just been on the ranch a little bit, the value of almost every other plot has, has gone up significantly as well. Like, Honey is up to 43 now, um, Boom is 55, Fire is is 65 right now and I have been storing uh, some fire slimes as well but what we're going to be doing to start off with is we're going to make ourselves some more novice pumps we're going to make some novice apiaries as well because we need the novice pumps to get ourselves the deep brine we need the novice apiaries to get ourselves the hexacombs so if we actually go down over to the lab for just a second I'm going to show you everything that has been going on. Let me quickly grab uh, these uh, silver parsnips over here. Every single one of these plots is silver parsnips right now. Because I'm thinking of um, making my mosaic slimes with a lot of different slimes. I think that's a good combination. Mosaic are worth a lot. So if we combine mosaic with uh, a lot of different slimes, then that might be quite good. So uh, that is uh, the plan. I'm actually not going to have a space to, to pick them all up right now. So I'm gonna those, I'll put those in the silo in just a second. But what we need to do is we're working towards the pink attack. Teleporter. We need pink plots, which I've collected quite a few of them. I've been going into the cave. I've actually got some more pink phosphorus uh, uh, logos in there now. So we've got a lot of pink uh, plots is what we need. We need 10 deep brine. We did put a couple of pumps down in the last episode, so hopefully we can get some deep brine from those. And all we need is the hexacombs. And to make the hexacombs, we need the novice apiaries. And we need pink plots, phosphor plots, and honey plots. And we actually have the honey plots as well, because I went into the... Um, the grass marsh is it called the grass marsh the gra the, the moss blanket there we go the grass marsh no idea where i got that from so i went into the moss blanket i got a couple of um honey plots and i've combined rock and honey together so uh we're gonna be getting the rock ones because we need rock for um for some stuff as well and uh, of course we do have honey plots as well so let me go quickly grab those honey plots uh, they are going to be in here. There we go. We've got 31 of these, so I'm going to go and grab these. I'm going to grab some of these rock ones as well, just because we do have quite a lot of rock ones in here. So let me grab some of these rock ones as well. We put those in the lab as well. Uh, I'm going to get some boom ones, and I'm also going to get some tabby ones, because we do have a... Uh, oh, oh. Okay, never mind. That was the wrong one. Let me go collect those up again. How many do we have? We have another six hoodie ones here. There we go. So we've got... Uh, let me grab one from here. There we go. So that's full as well. We got a lot of rock. We got a lot of um, mosaic. Uh, in here we have the boom ones. We got plenty boom ones. I I, I want to spend some of these on currency, but right now I think the lab is a little bit more important. So uh, we're gonna unlock these. And apparently, if we create, oh, I actually uh, ran out completely. Apparently, 
if we create like a hundred different things in the lab, we get the treasure cracker for the legendaries. So that means that we can get almost everything, which is uh, what I want. So there we go. We got 50, 50 rock, uh, 49 boom. I could get one more, but it's okay. 50 tabby and some honey. So we should be able to make our apiaries. We're going to make ourselves some more pumps as well. And uh, hopefully at the end of the episode, once we come back from the glass desert, these are going to be complete and uh, we can get uh, the rewards from them and then actually make the pink teleport. So we'll throw all these in here. Look at all this currency that we could technically be getting, but we're not. We're putting these in the lab instead. So uh, boom ones as well. And then the tabby ones. We'll make some more pumps. Not too bothered about the drills. We don't really need anything with the drills just yet. So we're absolutely fine though. As far as I'm aware, with the Apiary, we don't need to put this anywhere. So we can make some of these. How many How many of these should we make? We'll make We'll make five of these, and Novice Pumps will make... How many of these can we make? Uh, we'll make five of those as well. So uh, let me go down to the, to the Novice Pumps that we have down here already, because I'm not sure if we can just put six down of each, so we can put six drills down, six pumps down. I'm not exactly sure if that's the case, or you can only have six, like, gadgets down at the same time. I'm hoping it's not just six gadgets, because, yeah, that wouldn't be good. So, let's open this and let's see what we get. Okay, we get primary oil, and we get deep brine. So we've already got enough deep brine, guys, I think, uh, for what we need. Anything else? Nope, we get, actually, no, we get a spiral steam as well. There we go. So, um, primary oil, spiral steam, and a deep brine. So, we have enough deep brine now, so we don't actually need to worry about the pumps right now. Uh, we have 13 deep brine. Hello, thank you very much. So, uh, we got those down now. What we're going to do is we're going to place down some of the apiaries. I'm not sure how long it's going to take for those. Let us have a look. We can place them down here. So, uh, let's place them here. Apiaries. How long are these going to last for? These are 22 minutes. Okay. So, the episode's still going to be going when these hopefully finish. That's that's provided that they continue going, you know? Hopefully, they'll just continue going when I'm not in the location. So, there we go. We'll put the apiaries down. And uh, let's actually see if we can place pumps down. Can we place pumps down as well? There's one pump. There's two pumps. So, it looks like we can place uh, more than... It, it is like five of each individual or six of each individual which is good that's what we want to see so um there we go we put all these pumps down i'm not sure why i get in this location of the pump because i don't think this is the the far far range this is just the ranch so we'll have to see what we get uh there but uh let's go put all of these materials into the machine because we have the um the apiaries down which are now going to give us like the the hexacombs that we need we got uh, primary D oil, uh, which is pretty cool. Spiral steam seems to be the raw material uh, over there, which is pretty cool. But if we look here now on the pink teleporter, we've got the pink plots, we've got the deep brine. Uh, oh, I needed 10. I thought I only needed 6. All we need is the hexacombs now, which is going to be uh, hopefully not too long before we get those. Uh, what I'm going to do now is we're going to head over to the glass blanket. Uh, the glass blanket. The glass desert. Because I'm going to show you exactly what we did in the last episode. And to be honest, it was a pretty big episode. Not in the last episode. In uh, the episode which I couldn't upload, which kind of sucks. But, um, yeah, we're just going to have to... Uh, I'm going to show you guys exactly what we did. What is the trade? Eh, not too good. Let us actually uh, read this e this mail, what we have. Let me read the mail. What do we got? Uh, life is different now. I had a year to think about things while you slept on your way across the stars. I think it almost scared me when things got easier, and when I finally realized that because we na we each have... What? I finally realized that what we each have now is what we wanted all along. Because you're still that girl I know, you're happy out there on the very furthest frontier, and I hope the happiness you feel now lasts forever. I hope that the sunsets over the... over the are as gorgeous as they are over here, and that if you search far enough on the rainy day, some ranch right there has a taco stand that you can visit. I realise that w that last one probably isn't likely to happen, but it sure would be romantic, right? I'm glad I've shared a part of me with you, Beatrix Labu, and I'm happy to know that maybe one of those stars I see up in the sky is you. Very cute, isn't it? <laughs> so, let us go down to the glass desert. Which is the quickest way to go? I'm trying to think, which is the best way? I generally don't know which is the best way to go to the glass desert. Probably the moss blanket, to be honest. Yeah, let's go through the moss blanket. That's probably the quickest way to get to the ancient ruins. Still no idea where the quantum slime is, but we do have the quantum gordos, should I say. Uh, but we do know where there's quite a few gordos, and I did find quite a few in the glass desert as well. So I'm going to have to try and show you those as well. 
So let's go ahead through this teleporter. We'll head to the moss blanket and uh, I will cut the video here once I am at the glass desert. All right, guys, so we are now in the glass desert. I happen to find a golden slime, but then it disappeared. So we didn't manage to get ourselves anything good. So uh, we might as well get rid of these plots because we're not going to need them, are we? So uh, in the last episode or the episode that wasn't recorded with the glass desert, I can't actually remember if I completed these, this garden a little over here. But uh, we managed to get this garden done over with the water. I don't think we did get this one done, actually. So we managed to get... Actually, no, we did. We did because we got the Gordo, didn't we? Okay, never mind. Um, we managed to get that done, but we mainly went exploring in uh, the episode which the audio did not work. Alright guys, so I'm now in the glass desert and I'm actually going to be showing you exactly what we did in the episode that the audio messed up on. This episode is not on the channel, I can put it on the channel if you want to, but uh, I'm going to be explaining exactly what we did. It was a very exploring or explorative um, episode and uh, what we did is we opened this door here. So we needed a slime key and we decided to open this door and uh, through, this, uh, through this location, we went exploring. I haven't explored uh, this location over here yet, but it looks like we're going to need some plots to be able to get that statue so we can get the water fountain going. What we did was we took a right down here, came down here across some very angry slimes, and uh, we took another right as well. Let me go grab these plots here a second, just in case we're going to need those for the, for the whatchamacallit, the, the statue. So we came down this way. And uh, as you can see here, we now have a little garden going. So, ooh, there's a there's a tabby slime. Well, the money tabby slime, should I say. There he is. There's, there she is, should I say. You don't eat anything. I need, I need meat. I don't have any meat, unfortunately. So, uh, yeah, we got this location done over here. And if we go through this little cave over here, we end up in another location, which is just over here. Where are we? Where are we going? This way. So, you come this way. I'm actually coming a different way to the original way I went. So, we, we explored this entire new location. And we we found some awesome stuff. So, we, we got another garden and completing it all completely. This over here is very interesting. If you look over where this bit is here, you can see there is a slime under construction. If they bring a new environment or location, which I believe they will, it's probably going to be out here. And I believe this is called the Sand Sea or something like that. Or the Sea Sand um, yeah, it's like sea, but it's all watery sand. So maybe that's what the new location is going to be. And it's going to be in this direction over here, which I think is pretty awesome. And I'd be excited to find out what the new location is going to be there. Um, but if we head uh, this way as well, we come across some new little location up here. And uh, there's a couple of gardens. So we got this one done over here. Uh, the fountain's all the way up there. We got this garden done over here. And uh, look at this, there's actually some like water pools and everything over here, which looks, I think looks incredible and looks awesome. Uh, let me go grab these as well, actually, just in case we need those for the new statue, so at least we know which plot we need. So uh, these have got like little water pools, which I think is good. There's like little puddle slimes in them and everything, which I think is really cool. Uh, we also have another location, which we did over here. Here we go. And uh, this one is a nice little water fountain and, and everything like that, which I think is pretty cool. And uh, this is all the location that we explored, but it did take a little bit longer to, to do than just that brief little description. But we found all of this new location, which I think looks awesome. And uh, I generally have no idea where, where I want to go now, because we still have a little bit to do. And uh, there's still more to explore. So maybe we should head in this direction now. I don't think I have been in this direction. I don't think I've been in this direction. It's just danger. So we want to watch out for the danger. There is also a slime. Let me find a Gordo. I think it's the Mosaic Gordo. So if we head over in this direction. Wait for our energy to go up. We want to fly over to here. Let me wait for my energy to, to, to come back. And then we're going to head in that direction. So we want to head over here. I think it's this little bit here. I'm not exactly sure exactly where it is. No, it's up, it's up in that direction. Okay, so how do we, how do we get over to that section then? That is the interesting question. Maybe we can jump on the tree. On the tree. And then maybe somewhere a little higher. Oh, we can probably go up here, actually. Yeah, we can go up here. From here, we can go up here. There we go. Okay. Yep, it's going to be this way. So we go up here. 
and fly up here. And here we go. Here we have a mosaic gorda, which is actually opening up another location. You like veggies. Unfortunately, I don't have any veggies for you, my friend. But there is a new gordo. So uh, that's pretty cool. Did we find another gordo? I can't remember if we have found another gordo over here just yet. But let's head down in this direction. I want to head in this direction. I want to see exactly what is over here. I don't know if being up here is kind of taking away the experience or not. I don't know. There might be like a treasure pod that we can open or something like that. What do we have over here? I have a feeling it might be like a teleporter or something to, to head back home maybe. I don't know. Let us have a look. What are you? You are very sparkly over here. Nope, we have a big location. There's another slime door. Maybe that's going to go to the door that we could have opened um, on the other side where the first water fountain was, maybe? Maybe that's what it could be? I, I have no idea. What are these? These are very sparkly. Yeah, this this all could be like a new, a new location, guys. And I'm excited for it. Okay, so we got one here that we need to, to uh, add water to. That would explain this slime door over here. Unfortunately, we don't have a slime key for that. But maybe that's what we need to do. We need to activate this one. There might even be an achievement. Should we check the achievements? Let me check the achievements to see if there is one for all of the glass desert. Complete the Slimepedia. Not quite yet. Snurro Hunter, Hunter Gordo. Okay. Bring, uh, start bringing life back to the glass desert. We've done that one. Purchase at least 10 different types of slime toys. Uh, score 50 points on a single game of Slime Ball. I have not played Slime Ball, but I do know we could get that. Uh, place a tower on the number one slime stage. Nope, not done that yet. Fabricate 35 slime science gadgets. We've done 22. Fabricate 100. Maybe this one's going to give us the advanced treasure cracker. And then this one is the uh, the like legendary uh, cracker. Uh, these are... Send an adorable chick to a fiery end in the same place you're now destined to go. Um, okay. Maybe we throw that onto Ash. Reach at least 10,000 new books at the end of a five-day rush. These are five-day rushes. Uh, have three different types of Lagos in the si same corral. Well, that would be a very, very crazy thing to do if you have food to give them. Fill a pond on your ranch with at least five different types of slime. Okay. Have at least ten different Lagos on the ranch. Have at least six different types of slime in the same corral. Constrain more than 15 slimes in your vac stream at once while on the range. We've done 12 maximum. Hold on to a tar for 15 seconds. We've done three seconds. <laughs> Stand inside a rad aura for at least 15 seconds. We've done nine. And uh, some more other... Wait a minute, what was that achievement? I thought we'd done that one. I'm pretty sure there was one there about a silo. That I'd not done yet. Completely... F oh, and completely fill one. Okay, never mind. So, we've got a water fountain over here. I have a feeling that's going to be... The slime door over there is going to be... Uh, the other slime door which we could have opened so that's good to know maybe we shouldn't open that door do we need to open that door or should we save the keys maybe for something else but um we may have some some like water like little crazy thing over in this direction as well do we have anything over here that needs growing maybe 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 not Anything over in this direction? Nope, nothing in that direction. Anything down here at all? Oh, we got the little firestorm. There's actually nothing down here. I was thinking, the, what is the point of this then? I don't understand what this is then. Maybe it's just like getting you ready for the next, the next biome that's going to be brought, which I don't know when it's going to be. I have no idea when it's going to be, but... I'm interested to find out, that's for sure, so looks like we don't really have anything right now to explore, I don't think. Have we done everywhere in the glass desert? We might have done everywhere. I don't know if we have or if we haven't, but yeah, we have this little location as well. Hold on, hold on. Where is that? Was it you that made the twinkling noise or is that another gold slime? I thought I heard a gold slime. I heard a tingling. I don't know if it was a gold slime or something different. If it was a gold slime again and I've missed out on it, that would be kind of annoying. There would be two gold slimes in the same episode. And I have no idea where it went. If it was a gold slime. I don't know. It could have been a tabby one, couldn't it? There it is again. Is it up here? 
No, no, no. Oh, it's them. Oh, it's the it's the mosaic slime that's making the noise. I kept thinking it was a gold slime. Oh, man. Can you stop making those? I keep thinking it's gold slime. So, that's pretty much what we've explored in the glass desert. We do actually have one little other section, actually, which we do need to explore. Which is on the left. So, we're going to go ahead and do that. I can also hear ta. So, maybe we should try and get that. I'm actually going to need to take... Let me get rid of these pink clots here. Um, no, you can go away. Let me get these prickly pears over here. We got one. I want a second one. Where's the second one? Oh, oh, I don't know. I'm on 68 health, so I don't really care right now. We got one prickly pearl, which is the main thing. And from here, we need to head home to actually plant it. But before we do that, let us fly over to this side. Okay, we need mosaic. We need mosaic ones. Okay. So I don't have any of those right now. Um, there's another one down there. There's a tr legendary treasure cracker down there. There's the water fountain. So, is there any mosaic slimes that we're going to have around here? No, there are not. The answer is a big fat no. So, let me go get some mosaic plots. We're going to need those to be able to and get that fountain done. So, let us head down in this direction. I'm pretty sure this is where the slime door is. Yes, it is. So, let's go ahead through here. Let's go get some mosaic plots. Where are the mosaic slimes? Come on, slimy wimey. Where are you? There you are. You like veggies, don't you? Well, here's some carrots for you. Oh, oh, one second. Let me get rid of that. Let me grab these carrots. There you go. You can eat each one. Thank you very much. Oh, no. Oh, no. I need to get rid of something else. Tangle plots. We get rid of you. I think in total you need, like, three plots, I think. All right, come on, eat those. There we go, thank you very much. There we go. We got three, and we got another carrot for you over there as well. Give me another one. Thank you very much. And there's that twinkling again. I keep thinking it's a gold slime or something. Oh, man. It's so distracting, you know? So, so distracting. I keep thinking it's the wrong thing. All right, do we have enough energy? Yes, we do. Okay. So let's go place these uh, plots in the, what do I call it? Ooh, a couple more prickly pears. I will gladly take those. Thank you very much. So let's start off with this one. Oh no, oh no, I don't have the energy. I don't want to fall down there into the sand. Ooh, that was close. I have no energy left over, guys. Okay. Well, let's start off by firing. Great. Great. We'll fire you first. Where is the second one? How do I get out of here? I need I need to get out of here, don't I? Okay, so I run up this way like this. Okay, so that's how I'm going to get up. We know how to get up. Now all we need to do is feed the statues. The second one is up here. So, is there any way I can get up a little higher? I could use my jetpack, which is fine, but... I'd rather not, you know? Okay. Okay. There's number two. And where is the third one? Where are you? Are you behind this wall? Not that I can see. Where is it? There should be like one of those little root things over here as well. Hmm. Where is the third one? Last time I was looking for one, it was literally in plain sight. And I just totally missed it. Oh, please don't tell me I'm dead now. Please don't tell me I made a mistake and I'm dead. I think I'm dead, guys. Let me wait for my energy to come back. I may be dead. I may, I may be dead here. Come on. No, no. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, no, we're not dead. We're not dead. We're safe, guys. We can get out of this. Woof. That was way too close. I literally thought that I was just going to have to fall into that sand and be dead. But we're not. We can get out of it. There we go. The question is, though, where is this third statue? I'm guessing it's on the island, but where is it? Where is it? Are you down here? 
There's already this one here, so I'm guessing it's not down here. There's one more that I need to to hit. And I have no idea where it is. It's not over here, is it? No. Where is it? It's got to be on this island. It's got to be on the island. Maybe it's over in this direction? I wouldn't have assumed so. No. Mm-mm-mm. Where would it be? It's probably in plain sight and I've gone past it so many times. But I can't see it. Where would you be? I would have expected it to be around here. But it's not. I'm going to fly over to the main side and see if it's over on... Oh, it's right there. Oh. Oh. What an idiot. It was right there the entire time, guys. Oh, man. What an idiot. So, how many do we have to do? We've got this one, and then we've got one over at the side that we need to do. And I think that's it. I think that's the only ones that we need to do with the magical water. So, we should be able to get them both done in the same one. I'm assuming. Okay. There we go. We've got, we got 28 seconds to get this done. We should be able to get this done. Get them both done. Yeah, we should be able to do this. Oh, not when it likes. Okay, okay. There's number one done. Oh, oh, I almost fell through that then. And there's number two. So let's take a look at the locations. Look at all the slimes that just appear. You get so much life. As soon as this happens, so much life comes into them. Look at all the slimes that have just appeared. So many slimes. And let's take a look at this little, little section over here. Yep, all nice and brought back to life. It looks amazing. I like it when things like that happen, guys. But um, I think we're pretty much done with the glass desert now. We're going to head back. Hopefully, these pumps and everything are done. So we can just come back to the glass desert anytime we want to. But I really want to start getting into the more gadget side of things. And uh, the 7Z rewards and things like that. Because you can get some really cool stuff from the 7Z rewards. So uh, let us head back through this teleporter. Hopefully, the pumps are done. Hopefully things have still been going okay while I'm over in this direction. Um, you've run out of chickens, which is, I guess is a good sign. Uh, has this gate always been there? I'm guessing so. I've just never took notice of it. It might just be an upgrade. Okay, so I didn't actually put any down over here. They're all over here. And are you done? Are you done? Yes, you are. Nice. So let me throw these rock plots in here. Okay, that's very full over there. So we're going to have to... To collect some of those. Let us fire this out and see what we're going to get. We get buzzwax and a hexacomb. Okay, we got one hexacomb. We got two hexacombs. Oh, please be enough. We didn't get a hexacomb then. No. Oh, no. We need three hexacombs in two pumps. Okay, we got one pump left to get another hex to get two hexacombs. And we don't. Okay, so we need two more hexacombs, guys. And we don't have any pumps left over, which kind of sucks. So we're going to have to make the teleporter in the next episode. Uh, what do I... What can I not get? Okay, we got Bullswax, Hexacomb, and Primary Oil. Well, let us get all of these here. A lot of Primary Oil, that's for sure. What are you? You're Lava Dust. Ooh, you're a rare one as well. Hello. Okay, let me go finish off with this pump. There we go. Okay, so there's quite a bit that I that I can't get right now. Let me put these hexacombs in here. We'll put this primary D oil in and the buzz wax. And uh, that's going to be, I think, us done for this episode. So hopefully you guys did enjoy it. Sorry about the no commentary uh, that we missed an episode uh, prior to this. We're actually going to need to make some more of the apiaries so we can get some more beeswax. I didn't realize it was going to be that difficult to get. I thought it was going to be a little bit easier than that. I thought that was going to be the common one for them, which uh, unfortunately it is not. So, sorry about that, guys. What did I just fire? What did I just... Oh, no, I just threw the... I just threw the prickly purrs away, guys. Can you believe I just threw the prickly purrs away? Oh, what an idiot. What an idiot. I wanted to plant those. I'm going to have to go back to the glass desert now for that. 
Well, at least it gives us an excuse to go to the glass desert in the next episode. Because I want to grow these prickly pears and stuff. But for now, let us grow these uh, silver parsnips. I think these have tapped out. Uh, nope, you're still going, but you are not. So, I'm going to put these away. We're going to collect these other materials and call that an episode. So, um, yeah. Hopefully, you guys are still enjoying it. We're going to get more into the lab side of things, I think. Uh, okay, you're on 100. So, let me go put these, these in here. Because... We don't, we don't have any beats. We're ready for you right now. We do have some, but I want to maybe save those for the hunter and, that, uh, and the honey, should I say. So, we got spiral steam and we got lava dust, which I, I'm pretty excited about. A survey on the state of this matter answered undecided. Lava dust is definitely really rare then from those pumps. Because I thought the spiral steam was the rare one, but lava dust is even rarer, so... Pretty interesting. We're getting some good materials here, guys. I definitely want to look into the lab stuff uh, more often. We can still get blueprints. I did find a couple of uh, treasure things which I could get. Um, also, I want a novice guard or snare. Uh, bait it with food and wait. So I want to maybe create this as well, but we're going to need new books for that. And uh, we're also going to need to make ourselves some more apiaries, which we can do right now. So hopefully, you guys, did enjoy today's video. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Zero Exfusions, and hopefully... I'll catch you guys next time.